you came to UTA and you're getting your degree and that's your cake, you're eating dessert. You can go back for seconds, you can double up on icing on it, you can put a cherry on it, and all that's just winning some extra games. You get a chance to go out there and play in a national championship game, that's just icing on the cake for you. You know, so you get to go out there and have fun with it and not be nervous about it, not think that this is the end, no. This is the, this is where the start to the next place I'm about to go. We're about to lose our first class, they're about to graduate. And I hate to use the word lose, but they're about to graduate and move on. And they've really built this program. Morgan Wood came here, was not really recruited by a lot of universities, pretty much was told she wasn't gonna be a USA player and she wanted that so bad, she sought out the teammates. She helped recruit the teammates to get here to help build the team around her. So she chased her dream and now she's there. You know, she's on that USA team right now. So that's, that's pretty awesome to see her determination. Abby Duncan, another one who was an able-bodied player and all of a sudden went through surgery and next thing you know, had lost the use of her legs. You know, so she didn't know what was gonna happen with her life, was, was basketball over with. But instead, you know, she, she came to university and she's, she's given it her all. Now she's a Paralympic medal winner. And of course, we couldn't get there without Rose. I mean, Rose is our leader, our heart and soul of our team. And she's showing those girls the way, like how to train, how to go about things. And they followed her. Without their fire and their drive, you know, we have a nice program, but, but maybe we're not winning. But because they wanted it so bad and they wanted to get to that next level, they've taken us there with them. And to the girls on the team, um, the future players won't get to say it to you yet. You know, we don't even know who they'll be yet, but somewhere along the line, there's someone in a gym practicing and they're gonna get a full ride scholarship to UTA. And that's because of them.